Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we have a really interesting brain test. We need to solve this. We have 5 minus 5 times 5 plus 5 and plus 0 factorial. Right here on the left hand side on the bottom we have a lot of options. So right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. Try to find the correct answer and after 30 seconds we will check our answer. It will be the same or not the same. It will be more interesting for you and of course for me to see how many answers will be correct. Okay, we have 5 minus 5 times 5 plus 5 and plus 0 factorial. The first and the wrong way to solve it is to start with subtraction. So to start with this one, if we subtract 5 minus 5, we have 0. We are left with 5 right here, so 0 times 5. And we have the same on the right, plus 5 and plus 0 factorial. If you multiply this 0 by 5 factorial, we will have 0 plus 5 and plus 0 factorial. We all know that 0 factorial equal to equal to 1, so we have 5 plus 1, we'll have 6. So as you can see, we find our answer using a wrong way. I want to show this wrong way because it's really important. And as you can see right here, we don't have this option 6. Why we don't have it? Because we cannot start with subtraction or or addition if we have multiplication and division. So this one is absolutely incorrect. But how can you solve it correctly? So forget this method, this is incorrect. I want to show you because a lot of students start with subtraction, a lot of students start with addition. But in our case, we have multiplication. So we need to start with this multiplication. If we multiply this 5 times 5, so we have multiplication and division. We need to start with this. If we start with multiplication, what do we have? We have 5 in the beginning minus 25 plus 5 and plus 0 factorial. Okay, we start with multiplication and division. This is correct method when you don't have any parentheses. Let's go next. 5 plus 5, 10. So as you can see right here, we can write as 10 minus 25 and plus 0 factorial. Later, I will change this 0 factorial because 0 factorial equal to 1. So as a result, we have 10 minus 25 equal to minus minus 15 and plus 1. Of course, the answer is obvious, minus, minus 14. So this is final answer and the correct answer to this interesting problem. But what about you? Write your suggestion in the comment, write your question in the comment, what answer you prefer, what answer you solve it, what is your answer, maybe 25, maybe 15, and try to answer in a comment about your suggestion about this this problem and of course thank you for watching don't forget to follow my youtube channel i really appreciate it and it helps me a lot it inspires me a lot to making you interesting tricky problems so and write something down in the comment i really appreciate it as well thank you and have a great day i hope you enjoyed this brain test